So my friends, I got uh, somehow disconnected as I was uh, recording that video of the unified field and multidimensional realities and just want to end uh, the, the post by adding a little bit uh, just now and I'm going to ignore that phone. I'm going to add a little post and that is that um, the reason that um, physicists sometimes have um, not figured out the unified field even though they're trying to is that they think only of four forces, the electromagnetism, and the strong and weak interactions and gravity. But where is consciousness in all this? After all, consciousness is an activity of the universe. That activity of the universe is allowing me to communicate with you right now. The electromagnetic waves are uh, an expression through um, which I communicate with you right now. Um, but uh, my consciousness is transmitting my thoughts which are coming to you in the form of these electromagnetic waves. And I think as long as um, people look at the universe purely objectively without looking at consciousness, the unified field theory is going to elude us because um, uh, the one we are looking for is the one that's doing the looking all the time. A new science has to emerge that includes both subjectivity and objectivity as uh, experiences of the universe. And both the subject and object as uh, differentiated aspects of that unified field. I know a lot of people object to this kind of thinking. They think it's new age gobbledygook, but uh, uh, they have never actually taken the trouble to experience their own consciousness in its pure form. So enough for now. Um, I'll uh, communicate with you again soon. I know there's been a lot of activity um, on uh, these video blogs and I need to respond to a lot of those people's comments um, and I will. Thank you so much for, um, for um, listening and participating.